Got Talent has always attracted a high pedigree of dancers. Samson! Flawless! Diversity! Well, now there's a new mover in town. Max the Dog! Good dancer? Yeah. Very good dancer. Ten months ago, we found out by accident that Max could dance. Oh, I think he... D is he trying to go for you then? No, he's just jumping in front of the face. And every person we showed this to just says, you ought to put him on Britain's Got Talent, so here we are. What do you think the chance of you going through to that and possibly winning the competition? I've never seen a dog uh, dance the way how he does now, like, so I really think he's got a very good chance indeed. Who are you, please? Um, Daniel. And... David. David, are you his dad? Yes. And who's the little furry creature? Matt. OK. Oh, I bet I'm going to let you get started because I can see he's itching to go. Daniel. Yeah. Yes, so were we. But here on More Talent, we believe that every dog should have its day. Let's see it dance. Let's give it a try. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So he's rubbing himself on your face? That's right, yes. <laughs> How often do you do it? Once a day. Once a day, seven days a week? Seven days a week, yes. And why not? <laughs> On a scale of one to ten, yes. what would you give the dog for the action? For the action I'm rubbing on the face? Yeah. Definitely nine. What could that dog do for you to make it a ten? Stop on my face longer, probably. Stop on your face longer? Yeah. <laughs> it's absolutely brilliant experience. Yeah. I'd recommend anybody to try that.